A few beers after work led to the brilliant idea to drag race down a country road in the middle of the night, with foreseeable consequences. But was it the surviving driver's fault that his opponent died? The court in Commonwealth v. Root had to decide. One May evening in 1957, Leroy Root and his co-workers from the Downington Paper Box Company congregated at a bar where they drank beer late into the night. They left the bar around 3 a.m. Lewis Hall suggested to Root that they race their cars down a rural three-lane highway. The speed limit was 50 miles per hour, but their cars reached speeds between 70 and 90 miles per hour. The drivers reached an area where the three lanes narrowed to two, and the road was designated a no-passing zone. Root was in the lead in the right lane, and Hall drove in the left lane trying to pass him when a truck appeared from the opposite direction. Hall swerved, but ended up driving head-on into the truck. He died in the crash. The state tried Root for involuntary manslaughter. The trial court convicted him, and the superior court affirmed. 